Hello everybody, we are doing a repeat today, um, of the how to download Minecraft mods without WinRAR 7-zip. Yeah, last time we didn't have a mic, so I thought that would have been pretty hard to figure out, but we're going to restart, and so the first thing you're going to want to do is open up your internet browser. You're going to want to open, oh great, hold on, put it on full screen. So then what you're going to want to do is type in skydaz.com. So you got these, but you're going to want to come to this one where it says skydaz minecraft installers tools, mods, maps, and textures. See, I'm in 1.6.2, so yeah, so we're going to go there. Let's just look for it. Let's just look for a tiny mod that we can probably hold. Maybe like something like the... We'll just look for the Solar Apocalypse mod. Because that was one of the... That was the new series I was going to do. Okay, so it's right here. Solar Apocalypse Mod for 1.6.2. So you're gonna want to hit on that, and this will work for any mod if you have my Cut Forge. So then you'll bring you up to this page. You're gonna want to scroll down. Hurry up, computer. Okay. So you so you want to click go to downloads and click on download here dot zip, because I'm not sure how it works with mod loader. I'm not actually sure. I only because I use Forge. I don't use mod loader. So so then this page will pop up called add add f dot flat dot ly. So I don't know really. And it, so it's right here where it says please wait. You're gonna want to hit skip add. So then, what you're gonna do is hit save. So now it says down here it's been downloaded. You're gonna want to open it. Um, click on the folder. Hit click on that one. Hit extract all. It's really simple, actually. Hit extract. Okay, now it's open. Open up the folder again, and then click on this. Now, warning. Um, the game cool can crash sometimes, so you gotta be careful. And then you're going to want to, oh, wait, Minecraft is open. There we go. So then we're going to hit install mod. Yes, you're going to want to hit back up your Minecraft. So then we can close out all of this because we really don't need it right now. Oh, I'm going to pause the video. It didn't tell it's done. Okay, I'll be back. What the? Pause the dang video. Wait, wait, wait. Alright everybody, I am back. So when it's done, this will pop up, so the backup of your Minecraft has been created, blah blah blah. So you're going to hit OK on that. And then it's downloading right now, I just gave it a second to pop up. Now if you have too many mods, your game can crash. Like, you might have to get rid of some if you have too many. That's why I move into my laptop instead of. <coughs> I'm very, I'm sick right now, so hold on. Let me pause it. Wait, wait, wait. Why isn't it working? Oh, finally it installed. Sorry about that. I was actually trying to install mod. Well, now it's installed. So, um, knowing that, I think it's gonna crash. I don't, I'm not terribly sure, but I want the Solar Apocalypse mod for my ser for my new series. It's gonna because I'm gonna make a Solar Apocalypse series. Solar Apocalypse is actually a big hit to your to your channel, if you're wondering. If you guys watch my videos, um, 
like watch other like mods like like watch who, who actually tries it see and it works without crashing so now we're just gonna go to mod showcases um so we're just gonna show that it works um i'm not actually gonna spawn the solar apocalypse though because i really don't want to spawn that um, where's the Pandora's chest? There's a ch the the chest the chest that is in this mod is called the Pandora's chest. Oh, it's right there. So that is what summons the solar apocalypse. Um, then you got like obsidian, reinforce, and obsidian glass and crack dirt. So what you're gonna need is everything to survive, but uh, thanks everyone for watching. Please like, subscribe, leave any comments if you have any questions. And um, this has been the end of the video. Thanks for watching. Bye.